Hello, welcome to my channel. This is your girl Morgan of I'm Morgan Ashley. We talk a little bit about everything over here from reviews, hauls, vlogs, whatever it is, I'm gonna talk about it here. If you're a returning supporter, thank you so much for the continued support. I appreciate you. If you are new here, because there are quite a few of you who are new here, thank you so much for the support and subscribing to my channel. And if you're very new here, and maybe this is your first video, or you've checked out some of my other content, but are not yet subscribed, I would ask that you please do not leave my channel without subscribing. Because I mean, if you feel like we vibing, why don't you just subscribe? But before we jump into today's video, I do just wanna say I apologize, y'all. Life has been life in, so your girl has been a little bit MIA from her page. I'm hoping to be back consistent. I'm not going to put a promise on that. I really don't even wanna say that just because but life has been life and so you just gotta stay tuned um, to catch up with me, um, hopefully in some vlogs that are upcoming. And But without further ado, let's jump into today's video. So from today's title, you already know what today's video is about. It's about Janae Nailers of Hilo Lux, future collective collaboration with Target, y'all. Oh my gosh, our girl has gotten a collaboration with Target. If this is not a full circle moment, I do not know what is. Um, our girl was a manager of Target, moved on to be a full-time content creator, is doing her damn thing right now, and now she has her own collection with Target. If that is not inspiring, motivating, especially for her to be a black woman, I don't know what is. Okay, so of course I had to show support and support the line. There are some really great pieces in it. Of course, also like it's Target, who doesn't love Target? And also um, I am on a weight loss journey, so I have dropped 50 pounds and most of my clothing do not fit. So I am in the process of basically starting from ground zero and having to buy a whole new wardrobe. So when Janae launched her line, of course it was a no brainer had to support, but it was like also the perfect timing to add pieces into my wardrobe that are great basics, but also at an affordable um, price point. And that's exactly what she delivered. So um, she does have two parts to her collection. The first collection or the first part already did drop last month back in May. So I did grab some pieces from that. And also she has a second piece or portion or drop two of the collection actually dropping this Sunday officially on June 23rd. However, if you are like me and you're lucky enough to have a Target who released some of the drop two in store, then you're in for a treat because I got the pieces that I wanted to get. So I will be able to showcase to you, you know, the items that I loved, how they fit, is it worth it, how I'm styling it. Um, so please stay tuned and let's jump into it. First up, we're gonna start off with my favorite pieces of the entire collection um, out of the first and the second drop. Um, this is an item that when I first saw, I was like, I don't care what else she drops, I need to have it. And that is the best. Um, I'm wearing the black one right now. It also comes in white and it also comes in a lilac. Originally, um, I believe the lilac or the purpley pinky color was not available in stores. I believe it was only available on the app, but the black and the white ones were available in store. Um, these were a part of the first collection and I was one of those people who woke up in the morning um, to place my order on the app and I did get all three colors. However, once the girlies who actually went in store went to TikTok, they were already complaining about the size. And so I was getting very, very nervous. Um, so I decided to try my luck and head to one of my local targets. And luckily um, it had the collection and it had a great um, run of sizing. So I was able to try on the size that I originally ordered, which was a 12, but also um, try on a 14 and a 16. And luckily for me, I'm so glad that that Target had a 14 because the 14 actually worked out better than me. I would say the best is um, not made for people with larger chests. 
I can say the 12, it fit me really, really great in the waist area. However, on the bust area, it was just way too tight. It was suffocating my breasts and just was not flattering. So I would suggest if you are interested in the vest to please size up. Again, this was a part of the first drop, so it's not available on the app anymore, but I would say going into my Target just a few days ago when she released drop two, or well, when Target released it in store, there were quite a few white and black vests available in the store. So I would say, if you're interested in the vest and you weren't able to snag it um, when it originally released, try in store because I think there are people still contemplating on whether they're keeping it, so they're returning it or they ordered multiple sizes. So you might have um, luck on finding it. But going into the styling, so starting off with the black, white, the black one, um, as you can see here, I first styled it very casually. I think even though the vest, you wouldn't gravitate to style it with just you know, a cut off pair of denim shorts. I think the way I paired it, you can still, again, this is a piece that you can style it up and style it down. And, um, you know, this is a perfect example of that. Um, so I styled it with these denim shorts, which are from, I do not remember, so I apologize. But these sandals are from Arizona Love. They're like bandana. And then I paired it with my new Jacquemus, um La Pochette. No, not pochette. I forgot the name of the bag, but it's the big old, um, you know, bag that everyone had in the silver. I found it in a smaller version, but I'm wearing it as crossbody. And then I paired it with my Louis Vuitton hoop earrings. And I feel like this is the perfect look if you are just running around. Um, the collection was supposed to be for summer and resort wear. And I feel like this is a great look if you are running around on vacation and you are doing like a day trip somewhere, you are very comfortable at the same time, you look very well put together. And I feel like this is a great example of it next moving into the white now the white i love white white and gold in the summer is given and i think janae even said it rich bitch vibes okay it is given that and here from day to night literally how i saw the black where you're running around in the day doing some shopping in monte carlo and then going out in the evening to have a great time on vacation you can style the white with some heels and go about your time. So also um, these white shorts are actually from the first drop as well. These white shorts um, are in a size 12. I originally did try these on in 14s and 16s because I felt like the 12 was gonna be too small. And if you do not follow me on TikTok, go follow me on TikTok because I actually did um, some try on hauls for the first and the second drop on my TikTok. And you'll see, I left the shorts originally behind because I felt like they were not flattering. I will say that they are a little short. So if you are not comfortable with a little bit more leg out, they're, they are not for you. However, for me, I like showing my legs cellulite and all so um once i was able to try them on in size 12 actually when i was shopping for the drop two i picked these up but um going back into the vest i styled it also with my gold giovanni rossi um heels and then i paired also with um a vintage chanel bag that i had just to give you keep that same energy of the rich bitch vibes <laughs> but this is how i styled the white again if you are interested on not, or you, you don't know how to style it, just get the pieces from her collection. You're able to just do an entire look without having to think about like, how am I gonna wear this? And again, you can interchange the gold heels for like a gold flat sandal and you can still wear this on a daytime, as a daytime look. However, if you wanna dress it up, you can do that. And I think this really does show how this, vest is very versatile okay and next and last moving on from the vest we have it in purple um i don't even know what to call it it's like a purple but it's like a purpley pink um and this was in the size 12 that i originally ordered and again um it's it's too small okay i can't button it up but luckily for me she dropped the cropped topped that i have on and dropped to and i know i saw that so that is why i did not return the return this color when i returned the black and the white because i was like 
she's gonna drop that crop top and I'll be able to wear it open. And I was able to do it. Um, the crop top in this is in a size large. It's in the drop too. Um, but I just loved this color. Again, I'm rebuilding my wardrobe. Um, so I am starting off with basics and very neutral tones. However, it is the summertime and I do love color. So I felt like this color is a perfect um, complement to my skin tone, um, our melanin and a perfect color to have in the summer and the warmer months. I paired it again, dressing it up, but a little bit toned down from how I um, styled the white version. But still, this is a great look to go out for like drinks with your girlfriends during the summertime um, with my, these jeans are actually from Target as well. I love the way these fit me. I actually got these and I was totally surprised. I believe they're like a boyfriend baggy fit. I don't remember. I'll try to link everything below um, outside of her collection as well in the description box, but totally love these jeans. Um, I paired it with some Silver Express heels that I got a few years ago. And for the bag, I paired it with my Brandon Blackwood um, purple, lilac i don't know what to call it but my brandon blackwood bag which i felt like is it pretty much matches with the um vest and i really don't wear that bag like that so i felt like what an what not a better time than to bring that bag out but i really do love this vest um, i would say again it cinches you in the waist so perfectly it gives you a great shape it is the perfect like tailored look but again at an affordable price support our girl and i would say the material is great the quality of it is amazing i've already worn the black and the white one into the office and then i wore the white one again to go to happy hour and when i say like i have gotten so many compliments on where where is that from you look so nice so i would definitely suggest if you can snag it go snag it and since we're on top so i might as well stay off on that way so again going right back to that uh, purple vest but the crop top i would say um i actually realized that i did not feel me um get the back of it but that crop top i'm wearing in a size large she has a great um it comes in like a two-piece actually where there was like a skirt that goes along with it and this crop top is in the drop too if i did not say that already and um the skirt that went with it, it was super cute but i just know me i'm not really a skirt a midi skirt person so i just left it behind and the main reason why i wanted the crop top was to wear it with the vest open but i think it's really cute it has this great detailing in the back of like this gold ring um i'll try to pop up a video um if it's being shown maybe on the target app just to give you a better idea of it but i think it's super cute there is a zipper on it and there is a little bit of that elastic material in the back i am larger breasts and i would say i were again we're a large i probably could have did an extra large but i just felt i would have had um a little bit too much room to not like hold be able to hold up my breasts which i prefer when i'm wearing crop tops like that um even with a strapless bra so i would say maybe like go size down because an extra large was something that I, because an extra large is the size that i normally would have picked but again i just feel like it would have been too big but it's super super cute and i i would definitely recommend it another top that we have is this black top which i was in love with i did not even see this um i feel like during her promotion of the collection um, this was something that I was pleasantly surprised by when I was in store, um, but I just love the cut of this. I felt like it was super cute and just very feminine, um, and I felt like it was going to go with different pieces of the collection, like the shorts, how I paired with it. Um, the gold detailings of this shirt was super cute, um, and... I mean, I don't know. I just really, really loved it. And also I felt like it could be great, a great top for the office for me. I'm wearing the black top in a size 14. So I would say if you have the vest and you're interested in this top, definitely go with the size you are wearing in the vest because I feel like they are, you know, definitely correlate with the, the, the sizing is very similar when it comes to this top. But I feel like, again, this was a great top to wear into the office. These are one of these tops that I feel like you can just throw it on a pair of jeans and it, you know, it makes give you a little razzle dazzle just because of 
the detail as far as when it comes to the buttons the way it's cut it sort of has like a peplum um cut to it and then of course how the straps are it's just very it's a very cute top and something that's just easy to put on and still make your and still make you feel like oh i did something with an outfit and how i saddled this black top was very again another casual way this i paired it with the black shorts from her drop one and then i just paired it with these um leopard print um flat sandals that i got from zara about like a year or two ago and leopard is in so i <laughs> paired it with that um and then the bag i just wore my little fendi bag for something easy something you could just put on your wrist and go the outfit is very easy but well put together and i'm sure this is another piece that will be this top will be something else very complimented next up is this denim white tube top per se this is something that is from the drop one it's actually something i tried on and i felt like it was a little overpriced because i felt like the denim material was a little bit too thin and i left it behind um but i kept thinking about it i love the buttons i don't have anything like it and i tried it on originally with her denim jeans that she had a part of the first collection and the denim jeans were not my size i tried them on in a size 10 and they were too small so i just felt like this would have been the perfect outfit and since the jeans were no-go i just left of course i left i just left the top behind but again i kept thinking about that top and i saw that it was available on the app <clears throat> so i went and ordered it on the app excuse me i'm wearing this top in a size large i would say this one's large i originally got it in an extra large but i had a lot of room in it in the back of this top it does have that um stretch material so you are able to have a little bit more room you'll see in the video it looks like it's it looks like it's very tight and suffocating my breasts but i'm, I'm telling y'all i just have on the wrong strapless bra unfortunately that strapless bra is just giving me lumps and bumps in my breasts and if i had the right bra it would just look a little bit better but i would still say size down in this top um because if you go with your normal size or size up if you size up it's gonna be too big and if you go with your normal size it's probably gonna be too big um but i love this of just how i styled it um with just denim jeans i think it's super super cute and casual another outfit that can be worn out for drinks pair it with some heels or you can just wear this top with some denim shorts and you can wear it you know to do your errands during the day in the summertime i paired it with these denim jeans again from target and then i also paired it with my gold gm gian my gold gian vito rossi heels and then this gold clutch that i actually have from zara that i got about like two years ago and i felt like it was the perfect gold to go with the gold button detailing um and i actually really love this top because not only the buttons but the cut of it i feel like it's really flattering especially for a larger breast woman i think sometimes these types of tops can be very unflattering and could just be a struggle and i just felt like this top was just easy if you have the right bra morgan i just gotta get some more strapless bra but i just feel like it's a great top to have and can really elevate a simple denim jean look so let's move to bottoms you've already seen the black and the white shorts but these are again pieces that i originally left behind i don't know if i got into that but i was going to leave these shorts behind because i just felt like they were not flattering for me i felt like the crotch area was just a little bit too big uh, and it just didn't look cute on me but again i tried on a size 14 and a 16 originally and i just felt like they didn't work i felt like the size 12 might have just would have been too small and pleasantly to my surprise during the drop two when shopping for my pieces i was like let me try on a size 12 and the size 12 fit me now you might not think they fit me but i think they fit me and i like the way that they fit me because they are a little um short now i feel like they do they do have a flare i feel like to them um reminiscent of like those jack and Moose shorts that um they're like pink i feel like monroe still has the pink jack and Moose shorts that flare um and are just a little bit cheeky i feel like these are very, very reminiscent of those but i love the belt detailing on these so i feel like you're getting more than a short you're getting like an elevated short and again another easy piece to dress up dress down as you can see on how i styled both of them and 
I would definitely say that again the material on these are this light linen material uh, that's the same as the vest it is a great pair of shorts a again just easy going to bring on vacation or just wear your normal day to day during the summertime and lastly um, my last piece from the collection I would say the vest was my favorite but these are my second favorite and I believe I saw these in the promotion and I was like another piece I gotta have and this is the main this is the only reason why I went into the store once I saw the girls on TikTok showing that the drop two had dropped was these pants these pants are of pants, okay? I love, 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 love these pants. Now, they are something that I do not have. Um, the detailing of like that asymmetrical, how they're cut with the tie, I don't even know what to call it, the draping in the front, the bright red, tomato, orangey red. They're just so good, they fit amazing. I'm wearing a size large here um i paired it um i feel like for me since they are can be a little bit more dressy i decided to pair with just like a it, it's a graphic tee um that says that bitch that i got years ago i don't even remember who it's from um and then i paired it with these black steve madden um pumps that i have that are reminiscent of some christian louboutins and then i paired it with my vault label um bottega jody bad dupe and i just feel like this cute this outfit is so cute i would definitely wear this to dinner i love styling pieces like these pants that are a little bit more dressy with like t-shirts just a normal t-shirt to give it that more edgy look i love this look this is something i would definitely wear to dinner but also like i feel like these pants i can wear these to the office and again i'm having to rebuild my wardrobe so having these versatile pieces like these pants are amazing they are this light knit or i'm sorry not knit but they're like this light material it's not linen i don't know what it is but it's a very light material and very breathable i feel like even though it's a pant it's still a very perfect summer pant uh, to still take on vacation or wear, or wear during the summer months if you are in a hot climate like me in texas um this pant also comes in a very very light tan um i was trying to get those as well i went to like three targets but i could not find these in a size large um i knew a medium was just way too tight and the extra large was way too big um but for the second drop that drops on sunday on june 23rd i will be on the app very early in the morning trying to secure my large in the other color of these pants and then i'll be done with the collection but I really do enjoy these pants. You are tall, um, congrats to you. These pants definitely have length for you to wear heels or just you know wear flats. But if you're like me, I'm 5'5". Five five. I am gonna have to get these pants him just to wear when I do wear them to work because I don't really do heels to work. It is a great length if you wear them with heels, but for me, they're just a little bit too long but overall i loved the collection i feel like every piece that i've got is something that i'm really really in love with i feel like in this video as you guys can see the way i style these items you have endless options from dressing them up dressing them down um dressing them to be work appropriate these items are great quality there are other items that i did try that unfortunately were not a great fit for me but if you follow me on tiktok you can go check those out from the drop one and the drop two but i again i feel like if you found items that you know you were thinking about um or you were just hesitant to move on i hope this video helped you um, i hope it helped with the sizing if you had questions with that but if you have any other questions please leave them in the comments below and i will hope to get those to you before um drop to this upcoming sunday and i hope you guys overall enjoy this video and again congrats to janae on your amazing collaboration with target girl keep doing your thing but okay, see you guys in the next one. Bye. Through drought and famine, natural desire.